Today, we're diving deep into a topic that might surprise you, the hidden dangers lurking in your pantry. We often focus on exotic superfoods for our health, but what about the everyday staples that could be silently damaging our kidneys? The kidneys, those incredible bean-shaped organs, work tirelessly to filter waste and toxins from our blood, playing a vital role in maintaining our overall health. What we eat directly impacts how hard our kidneys have to work. Just like a car needs the right fuel to run smoothly, our kidneys thrive on a balanced and mindful diet. So, if you're ready to uncover the surprising culprits in your kitchen and discover how to protect your kidneys, stick around. We're about to break down six common foods that, while seemingly harmless, might need a second thought, especially if you're watching your kidney health. Let's get started. Let's face it, a juicy burger or a plate of sizzling bacon is tempting, but when it comes to kidney health, processed meats are at the top of the naughty list, and here's why. First off, processed meats are notoriously high in sodium. We're talking deli meats, sausages, bacon, and those convenient but often unhealthy prepackaged hot dogs. These salty culprits put a heavy strain on your kidneys. Think of it like this. High sodium intake forces your kidneys to work overtime to filter out the excess salt, leading to increased blood pressure. And guess what? High blood pressure is a major risk factor for kidney disease. But wait, there's more. Processed meats are often loaded with preservatives like nitrates and nitrites, which give them that appealing color and extended shelf life. However, these preservatives have been linked to an increased risk of certain cancers and can also harm our kidneys over time. Now, I'm not saying you have to swear off these savory treats completely, but moderation is key. Remember, your kidneys are not bottomless pits of filtration. Instead of making processed meats a daily staple, think of them as occasional indulgences. And when you do enjoy them, do so mindfully. Opt for lower sodium varieties whenever possible and read those labels carefully. Don't let the clever marketing fool you. Your kidneys will thank you for making conscious choices. Remember, taking care of your kidneys is an investment in your long-term health and minimizing processed meats is a simple yet significant step in the right direction. Up next, we'll uncover another surprising culprit hiding in plain sight. Stay tuned. Dairy products. They're often touted as essential for strong bones and a healthy diet. But when it comes to kidney health, the story gets a bit more complicated. While dairy can be a source of calcium and vitamin D, it's also high in protein and phosphorus, two nutrients that can spell trouble for those with kidney issues. Now, for most people with healthy kidneys, Moderate dairy consumption isn't usually a cause for concern. But if you're already dealing with kidney disease, it's crucial to pay close attention to your dairy intake. Here's why. Kidneys play a vital role in filtering phosphorus from the blood. When kidneys aren't functioning optimally, phosphorus can build up, leading to a whole host of problems like weak bones, heart issues, and even an increased risk of complications for those with existing kidney disease. Dairy products, especially cheese and milk, are particularly high in phosphorus. So if you have kidney issues, it's essential to work with your doctor or a registered dietitian to determine the appropriate amount of dairy for your individual needs. They can help you strike a balance between getting the nutrients you need while protecting your kidneys from further damage. Now, I know this might sound a bit alarming, especially if you're a cheese enthusiast like me. But remember, knowledge is power. By understanding how different foods affect our bodies, we can make informed choices that support our overall health and well-being. Let's talk about convenience. We live in a fast-paced world, and sometimes reaching for a can of veggies seems like the easiest way to get our daily dose of greens. But before you pop open that can, let's uncover the potential downsides, especially when it comes to your kidneys. Canned vegetables, while convenient, often come with a hidden cost-added sodium. To preserve their shelf life and enhance flavor, manufacturers often load canned veggies with salt. And as we've discussed, excess sodium can put a strain on your kidneys and contribute to high blood pressure, a risk factor for kidney disease. But it's not just the sodium content that's concerning. Some canned vegetables also contain unhealthy additives and preservatives to maintain their color and texture. These additives, while they might make the food look more appealing, can be detrimental to our overall health in the long run. Now, I understand that fresh vegetables aren't always accessible or affordable, and I'm not saying you have to banish canned veggies from your pantry completely, but being mindful of your choices can make a big difference. 
When opting for canned vegetables, look for low sodium or no salt added varieties. And don't forget to rinse the vegetables thoroughly before eating them to wash away some of the excess sodium. Remember, small changes can lead to significant improvements in your kidney health. By making informed choices and being aware of the hidden sodium content in our food, we can enjoy the convenience of canned goods without compromising our well-being. We're often told that whole wheat bread is a healthier choice than its white bread counterpart. And while it's true that whole wheat bread offers more fiber and nutrients, there's a catch, especially for those with kidney issues. The problem lies in two key minerals, potassium and phosphorus. Now, for most people, potassium and phosphorus are essential minerals that play vital roles in our body's functions. However, for individuals with chronic kidney disease, CKD, these minerals can accumulate in the blood leading to potential health complications. Whole wheat bread, while a good source of fiber, is also relatively high in both potassium and phosphorus. And while fiber is generally beneficial for digestion and overall health, in individuals with CKD, high phosphorus intake combined with high fiber intake can further exacerbate mineral imbalances. Now I know this might seem like a dietary minefield, but remember, knowledge is power. If you have CKD or are concerned about your kidney health, it's crucial to work closely with your doctor or a registered dietitian to create a meal plan that meets your individual needs. They can help you navigate the complexities of food choices, ensuring you're getting adequate nutrition while also protecting your kidneys from further damage. Remember, every case is unique, and what works for one person might not work for another. Bananas they're a breakfast staple, a portable snack, and a natural sweetener. But beneath their sweet and convenient exterior lies a potential concern for those with kidney issues. Potassium. Potassium is an essential mineral that plays a vital role in muscle function, nerve transmission, and fluid balance. However, for individuals with kidney disease, the kidneys may not be able to effectively remove excess potassium from the blood. This buildup of potassium, known as hyperkalemia, can lead to serious health complications including irregular heartbeats, muscle weakness, and even life-threatening conditions. And here's where bananas come into play. Bananas are known for their high potassium content. While a medium-sized banana provides a good dose of this essential mineral for most people, those with kidney disease need to be cautious about their intake. Now, I'm not saying you have to banish bananas from your diet entirely, but moderation and careful monitoring are key. If you have kidney disease, it's essential to talk to your doctor or a registered dietitian about the appropriate amount of potassium you can safely consume each day. They can help you create a personalized meal plan that includes a variety of fruits and vegetables while keeping your potassium levels in check. Potatoes and tomatoes. They're staples in countless cuisines adding flavor and substance to our meals. But these seemingly innocent vegetables can pose a potential challenge for those with kidney issues due to their potassium content. As we discussed earlier, potassium is an essential mineral that plays a crucial role in various bodily functions. However, for individuals with kidney disease, the kidneys may not be able to effectively remove excess potassium from the blood, leading to a condition called hyperkalemia. Hyperkalemia can cause a range of symptoms from muscle weakness and fatigue to irregular heartbeats and even life-threatening complications. And both potatoes and tomatoes, while packed with nutrients, are relatively high in potassium. Now, before you swear off these versatile vegetables entirely, remember that moderation and informed choices are key. If you have kidney disease, it's crucial to work with your doctor or a registered dietitian to determine the appropriate amount of potassium you can safely consume each day. They can help you create a balanced meal plan that includes a variety of fruits and vegetables while keeping your potassium levels within a safe range. Remember, every case is unique, and what works for one person might not work for another. By staying informed and working closely with your healthcare team, you can continue to enjoy delicious and nutritious meals while protecting your kidney health. So, there you have it. Six common foods that could be quietly impacting your kidney health. We've covered processed meats, dairy products, canned vegetables, whole wheat bread, bananas and potatoes and tomatoes. Remember, it's not about eliminating these foods entirely, but rather about making informed choices and practicing moderation, especially if you have existing kidney concerns. Instead of processed meats, 
Explore lean protein sources like fish, chicken, or plant-based options like lentils and beans. Swap out canned vegetables for fresh or frozen varieties and be mindful of portion sizes when it comes to dairy, whole wheat bread, bananas, potatoes, and tomatoes. What are some of your favorite kidney healthy swaps? Share your tips and experiences in the comments below. And remember, knowledge is power. The more we understand about how our dietary choices impact our kidneys, the better equipped we are to make healthy decisions. Don't forget to like this video if you found it helpful. Subscribe to the channel for more health insights and hit that notification bell so you never miss an update. Take care of yourselves and those incredible kidneys.